Hello, this is Chaudhary Mahmood Anwar. Today I'm going to illustrate how to prepare data file uh, for analysis in uh, Smart PLS. Um, if you want to construct a path model, then you can use the Smart PLS. So always remember that you have to uh, prepare your data file in Excel. Here you can see this is uh, the gender. Uh, this variable is uh, metal status. These two are control variables in, in my data file. Uh, these three GIT123 is the first um, latent variable, SAT1234 four, with four indicators. SAT is the second latent variable, uh, trust with the three indicators and uh, loyalty with three indicators. So in my data, I have a total number of uh, uh, 121 responses so what you need to do you need to save this uh, excel file in csv format for instance save as browse so you need to save your file select this csv comma delimited sample data for PLS one just you need to save okay some features of the workbook might be lost if you save it as CSV okay you want to keep using this format okay of course we have no other option so this is how uh, you will uh, save your file in CSV format for further analysis in Smart PLS, now I will open the Smart PLS. This is the Smart PLS. Okay, so first you will create a new project. Create a new project. You will simply name it uh, New Project. Okay. You can see this is New Project. Uh, here it is created. Double click to import data. You will double click this this uh, button to import your data. Here you can see sample data for PLS1. This is the data file, the CSV file we have created. Sample data for PLS1. So uh, whatever you want to uh, name this uh, file, you can. We will use the same file name. Okay. Once the data is loaded, you will see that the window has been changed and uh, the data is uh, loaded because I'm using the, uh, the student version of uh, Smart PLS. Therefore, only 99 records uh, have been loaded and the full data uh, comprises of 121 uh, responses um, have not been loaded. So uh, you will see these are the indicators this is new project this is the data the indicators you can see it's showing the number of indicators there are 15 number of indicators missing data is zero there is uh, any missing data uh, the mean of uh, every indicator mean uh, median minimum maximum standard deviation kurtosis and skewness this these are very important data uh, properties Indicator correlation. Here you can see the correlation between various indicators. And this is the raw file which has been loaded, the CSV file, into the Smart PLS. So this is how you will upload your data file. Uh, into smart PLS for further analysis. Thank you very much for watching this video.